Okay, for this next video, we're doing chapter 8 review. And we're specifically working on naming triangles by their sides. And remember, if you have a shape like this, whoa, okay, and it has these little tick marks in it, that means all those sides with the tick marks are the same length, okay? Just as a quick review. So my first triangle I'm gonna draw looks like this. Think if you can remember the name of it as I'm drawing it. It has three, three equal sides, okay? Since all the sides are equal, it has a name similar to the word equal. Does anyone remember it? You're right, this is an equilateral triangle. Okay. Um, so, an equilateral triangle has all equal sides. The next triangle will look like this. See if you can figure it out as I'm drawing it. Okay, it has two equal sides. What type of triangle is this? You're right, this one is an isosceles triangle. An isosceles triangle has two equal sides. And the last one could look like this. Okay. Are there any tick marks on this one? No, there's not. So there are no equal sides. Since there's no equal sides, we call it scalene. So this is a scalene triangle. Okay, so a scalene triangle has no equal sides. So as a quick review for it, you can have a triangle like this, which is an equilateral triangle, where all the sides are the same. They're the same length. Okay? Or you could have one kind of like this. This is an isosceles triangle. Where two sides are equal. And the last one looks like this. There's no tick marks, so it's scalene, which means no sides are equal. Okay? You need to pause the video and write this down and start memorizing it. I would. These are things you're going to need to know for tomorrow's test. See you guys later. Bye.